Now, while we have had uh, help and we've asked for help from other agencies, uh, local and state as well as fellow agencies, uh, we're still at the murder rate at this time of the year from last year. Uh, there are some crimes that have gone down, but we're still uh, in that fear mode that uh, uh, some folks would, would even say that Wilmington is under siege. And if you go into some neighborhoods, uh, they have a right to, to say that because in some neighborhoods, uh, they're basically under siege. We've asked the police from different agencies to come in and, and, and we got state troopers now, uh, Operation Pressure Point. Uh, we got state troopers on the north side of town who, who, uh, who are out there assisting the Wilmington Police Department. But I, 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 I put a pin in that, Mark, to say, wait a minute. The, the, the criminals are dictating to us how we should police. Now, we have an authorized script of 320-something people, officers, men and women. Uh, the, the, because of the, the crime and the escalation of crime, uh, I'm one of those folks that says you need to increase the police department. Council members are saying you got to use what you got. Well, because of the economy. That's true now because of the economy. But if you look at it, we've increased our authorized script unofficially by Metropolitan, uh, Metropolitan uh, by bringing in other agencies from within uh, the boundaries of the city of Wilmington to help and assist in our problem.